A cancer diagnosis is devastating for anyone, and to be told it's one of the most devastating forms of the disease, well, that's unimaginable. But groundbreaking research into pancreatic cancer is being carried out in Sydney with some wonderful results. Here's Jessica Turner. More than anything, Nicholas Nikiforov and his wife Elaine were looking forward to seeing their grandchildren grow up. But when Nicholas was diagnosed with pancreatic cancer a year ago, that simple dream seemed out of reach. The news from the doctors wasn't good. Uh, I had a tumour. We sort of said, you know, how long? And they said, um, our best research is that you know, maybe three to five years. Pancreatic cancer is one of the most aggressive forms of the disease. It was very hard. Um, needless to say, his moods swung from hopeful to, um, you know, why am I bothering? Sydney's Ingham Institute is researching how normal cells can help cancer cells spread, thanks to a grant which could save lives or improve quality of life for sufferers. Well, what we're hoping with this treatment is that it'll help either way. So basically, if we can now treat the cancer even before it's operated, we could possibly shrink it. Despite decades of research, pancreatic cancer is still one of the most difficult to treat, with fewer than 5% of patients surviving past the first five years. Nicholas and Elaine hope their story and those of high-profile sufferers will help raise awareness. I heard the Peter Harvey story by, as I said, I, we don't know the details, of course, but... He seemed to go very quickly. Nicholas is recovering well after surgery. He says he's enjoying watching his grandchildren growing up so fast. Jessica Turner, 10 News.